A friendship that blossomed on social media brought a young man with autism and our local survivor winner together. She traveled from Iowa. He came from Buffalo, New York, so they could finally meet in California. And last night we shared their very first meeting, and tonight the new relationship grows. CBS 2 News reporter Sadie Hughes joins us with a story you'll only see here on CBS 2 News. When Cedar Rapids survivor winner Denise Stapley first met Brandon Federowitz on her Facebook fan page, she had no idea he was using social media to learn how to communicate better as a person with autism. Nor did she know that would lead to friendship. And together they'd end up being teammates in an event called Reality Rally. An event that for them was about everything other than the competition. Purpose. Which way should we go? It makes the obstacles a little easier. It gives the platform to really try and make a difference. Right now, this is Denise Stapley's purpose, Reality Rally. All right. She's racing alongside Brandon Federowitz, who is here for his dad. He was a really good guy. He was funny and, you know, he loved his family very much. And if he was alive today, he would have been here with us. Autism makes it hard sometimes for Brandon to communicate. This rally is also his platform to honor, to love John Federowitz. That's the reason that I got the honor of participating is it's unfortunately because his dad died. Reality Rally creator Jillian Larson sees this as an opportunity for new purpose, for reality stars, for fans like Brandon. It's not what happens to you in life, it's how you deal with it that determines the path of the rest of your life. Reality Rally involves 11 challenges here in Old Town Temecula. It can last anywhere from one, two, three, or even four hours. Every moment is memorable for this former Survivor winner and mega Survivor fan. Oh my gosh, the letters was a blast. We had to lay on the ground and spell out. Follow this example. He did his reading, his math. Nine minus three. His socialization. Six. Six. He did it all. He did it all. Woo! All right. None of us cared. We're crawling around in the sand and digging for bags. So we, I mean, we're we're filthy. Okay, Lisa, come for Oh, more, more, more. Yeah. Yeah. I got it back on. Never give up. Then for this man from Buffalo, New York, and this woman from Cedar Rapids, Iowa, friendship, although very new, became their guide on the final challenge. Lift up your left foot. Okay. Lift a little bit higher. There's your first foot hold, okay? All right. We don't give up. Federal witches don't give up. You know you're my friend, Denise. I know. Reach the right foot. Yeah! Watching him get to the top of the wall was the best of the day. We had gathered an audience. I don't know who everybody else was that was standing there watching us get him to the top, and everybody <laughs> cheered. All right, Brandon. Oh, my God. Here we go. When they came in, the smile on Brandon's face was like he had, I, and he said, I climbed the wall, I climbed the wall. <laughs> to run up this, you know, the steps of City Hall with them, you know, as, as a family, you know, incredibly honored and, and just really humble. And even though we came in last because the, save the best for last, spirits are still up because of the reason why we're here. Because working through the pain comes from finding joy in the honor. I think he, he was so proud of me. He might have chuckled a few times, <laughs> but I believe he was proud. And from finding purpose for the life that awaits. Being with Denise is awesome. Um, I love her. They're just a pretty cool family, so it's great to be a part of it. I believe we're lifelong friends. Well, Facebook brought them together. The rally helped them honor Brandon's dad. And tomorrow night, the cause behind it all that unites them even further. I hope you'll join us. That's tomorrow night at 10. Sadie Hughes, CBS 2, 10 to 10. Mm. I, love that story. I do too. Yeah, good relationship building on social media, and it becomes so much more than oh, that. So you know? much more. Denise Stapley, I mean, she may have won a million dollars, but she just won all our hearts, didn't yeah, she? Yeah, absolutely. It's not about the money for her at so all. So not about that for her. Yeah. Way to go.